one constant in construction is challenge or change. Bully and Andrew's methods for solving problems in construction, I think, is hands-on. To be a superintendent here, you have to be a, a builder. A builder can see it when it doesn't even exist. They can anticipate a problem and head it off before it occurs. That's a builder. The company loves to embrace challenges. Everybody at Bully and Andrews got into construction because they love building. The common thread I see amongst our team here is just a sense of pride in what they do every day. We're not worried about challenges in terms of performance. We can do that. Quality is always the, the mantra, so nobody's gonna get a better product at the end of the day. The projects gravitate to us because of uh, the difficulty. But those are the kind of clients that we want because their expectations are here. And what our job is to exceed their expectations. Bully and Andrews was awarded the Belden Stratford Project, this amazing building up in Lincoln Park. The Bully and Andrews team really came together and from top to bottom having a knowledge base that was second to none was immensely important. So as we found challenges throughout this project, but they always came to us with two, three, or four different solutions. Bully and Andrews' communication throughout the entire project was first rate. You know, challenges are gonna happen on any project. Our attitude is that they're gonna be there. It's how, always how we react to them. So, you know, do we have a plan B? Do we have a plan C? Yes, to all those questions. When something comes up that seems like it's even impossible, everybody rallies around it. And then you come to realize this is what the company wants to do. We seek out challenges. At Notre Dame, there's always a very high level of expectation. We build buildings for 200 years. That's our, that's our mindset. We went through an extensive pre-construction effort, working out all the details, how things are put together on paper ahead of actually building it out in the field. These guys are team players. They're really here to help us with our design. They're trying to figure out what's the best way to get the best project. Pool plan scheduling is one way we really involve the client and the design team in the build process. And we really view our work as building a connection amongst that community of stakeholders. Their grasp of the cost of construction and what it was gonna to take to deliver this effort um, was impressive. When we asked questions, have you thought about A, B, or C? They were always ahead of us. They had answers. I want them to understand that I'm here for them, and I'm gonna to try to get them everything they're looking for out of their dollar. Construction can be a pressure cooker, and when it going gets tough, you gotta to get after it, and that's what we do around here. You're gonna face challenges on construction projects and you just need to know that you have a partner. The characteristics that I appreciated in Bully and Andrews is the integrity and their commitment to their word. Bully and Andrews delivers the best projects when we're able to enter into the process as early as possible and engage with the owner and architect so we can bring our expertise in constructability while they're working on design. That was one of the key elements that Bully Andrews played for us in the design standpoint is, can this be built the way it's being designed? Bully and Andrews is the construction manager that I want all of my other contracting partners to be. They manage a very tight process that benefits their client, which is our client, as well as our team. I looked at it as they cared and that they felt that this was their project just as much as it was mine. It's all about the craftsmanship, and you know, Bully and Andrews is there to provide that. And we really take pride in what we do. Our core values are something that they talk about right from the jump, and it starts at the top with the bullies. They care about their clients, and they, they really care about the product. I remember Allie Bully telling me that this is a gentlemanly company where we care about our customers, we care about our reputation, we care about the people that work here. We're proactive people in a company that has just been embracing opportunities or innovation or challenges. I think that's why this company does so well is because they are also so focused on finding the right person. 
the bulk of the people that you've talked to today and, and that have, have been part of this company have been here for 20, 25, 30 years and plus. It's a great core of people that um, really set the tone for what we do here. I have to work with people that I trust and that I respect. And so right away from the beginning, I felt like that, um, that I was surrounded by good people. My own personal core values are integrity, quality, honesty, and trust. And Bullying Andrews has those in spades. So I'm able to be myself here. It's really just been upward momentum since starting. You just have a lot of autonomy here but a lot of support at the same time, and I think they saw in me what I could be. And so 16 years later, here I am. When I walk through the building, I see an incredible amount of hard work, but not without being able to kind of take pause and one, teach people, mentor people, and just also take a step back and look at what we're doing and be proud of it as well. I learned from a guy that was with Bullying Andrews for 42 years. And so all I want to do is just keep passing on what he shared with me. I think my father and I are just amazed, frankly, at the talent, uh, talented people that we have here and you know what they're capable of doing. Our role is really to make this an environment for great people to flourish. To me, the most important thing is that people would look at this company and say that they're likable people to do business with and everything is transparent, and if they can't get it done for you, no one can do it.